Listen, I am going to play Apex Legends on my Nintendo Switch with a GameCube controller. Oh, batteries are dead. <sighs> what I'm about to say may or may not be controversial. <laughs> if you already play Apex Legends on PC, PlayStation, or Xbox, the Switch version is not made for you. It was made for Switch players. Basically, the Switch version is meant to bring in new players. I don't feel I need to go too deep into details on that, but let me know if you are playing Apex Legends for the very first time now that it's released on the Switch. And if anyone was expecting the same experience compared to other consoles, well, whose fault was that? Although it is kind of odd that the official gameplay trailer was rendered to look better than the actual game. Either way, I personally am very much enjoying it. It's nice to just kind of vibe out and play some casual matches on this thing. Now I wonder if I can casually rank up to Diamond. Now you might be wondering why anyone with a sane brain would put themselves through this kind of agony. <laughs> the answer to that is simple. It's for fun. The fun thing for fun. And to be fair, this is not the original GameCube controller, it is the Power A branded Nintendo officially licensed Switch version. So it has all the same inputs as a Switch Pro controller, but with the classic look and feel of a GameCube. And yeah, I may be at a bit of a disadvantage with the shoulder buttons because they do have some give before the signal is registered with the old clicky click. Ah. I feel like I'm starting to get to the age where my fingers just don't work as quickly as they used to. I'm like an elder noob. All right, let's see how this goes. Oh my god. This field of view is so zoomed in. Just from the training, I can see exactly why they would turn off, like let you turn off crossplay for Switch. <laughs> they don't, <laughs> they removed the performance feature. Honestly, I'm amazed they even got this game running on the Switch. <laughs> to be honest. All right, let's squad up. Ah! Ready up, bitch. It says I'm, I'm, it literally has a check mark on my screen. Oh, try unreadying ready again. I am. Oh, oh there, there it goes. Is. Oh, now it's gone. Oh. This is not an exact science. <laughs> <laughs> there it goes. Uh, it connected twice. Okay, it stopped. There it goes again. Third time. Yes. <laughs> First try. I'm the jump master. Oh my god. Oh my god. That. Oh. Oh no. This is, this is a, before. This is amazing. No. I already know. I already know. Uh, you guys are doing it. This is like GameCube sh <laughs> Oh, it's beautiful. It's fucking beautiful. Let's do this. Let's drop in the hot zone and just see what happens. <laughs> Open the fucking door. <laughs> oh, I can actually hear footsteps. <laughs> Nailed it. FNGs always go first. Purple. Someone's close. Yep, they're right inside. Sound detected right here. In combat. Flanking. Dead. Knocked. Oh, hello, Goldie. Ba -ba -ba bye bye. Oh my, more footsteps. Knocked one. Thank you, aim assist. Hey, this is my first fire. Got here. Ah! Jimmy, nice. Got here. Got here. Oh, we're both gonna. Yeah. Oh, it was Mark! Oh, bye, Mark. <laughs> Wait, how do you? Oh, you have to hold B. Oh my God. Do I hear more footsteps? Oh, people! Oh God, I'm dead. Oh, they're almost dead. Oh God. Oh no. Help! 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 Yep, yep, yep. What's up? <laughs> How do I heal? No! Oh my god! <laughs> that was so difficult. 
I can tell like which other players are also on Switch because they're having just as hard of a time as I am. <laughs> So clearly I've got my work cut out for me to uh, improve at this. So a couple of other things about the Switch version here is there is noticeable input lag, but I think after a few matches, you know, relatively easy to get used to. Along with the lower frame rate, it is what it is. I do suggest disabling crossplay so that you only play against other Switch players. Hopefully the queue times are not too long for that. <laughs> Let's just see if I can use the magic of a montage to get good at this, eh? Perseverance is key though, right? <laughs> I mean, that's what my friends keep telling me anytime I lose subscribers. I'm playing at like two FPS. Almost knocked the Bangalore. I think I'm just gonna have to run in there. I can't really do anything else. Yep, yep. I'll let you know when I'm getting in there. We can do it, we can do right, it. Right, ready? Yep. I'll scan and then we go. Do it. Scan. Watch out. Going. Bangalore down. Chasing the other one. Oh, he passed it away. He passed dropped. Away. He dropped. We gotta go, we gotta go. Let the ring get him. Yeah! We win! The ring got him! <laughs> Good work, boys. That was tough. Oh, look at the check! It's so blurry. Well, <laughs> listen. Listen, though, for real. The message I want to get across here is you don't have to be an Apex Predator to enjoy Apex Legends, especially on the Switch version. It's pretty much meant for casual play. Although I will be pretty impressed if I see someone get up to Diamond, Master, Predator on the Switch. It does seem like everyone is kind of starting from ground zero here, so everyone's kind of bad at it. <laughs> so I guess no one's bad at it. If everyone's bad, then no one can be bad, so we're all good at the game, right? Being the best is never really what it should be about anyway, unless you are legitimately trying to join a professional league, in which case I'm pretty sure you wouldn't be playing on the Switch version anyway, but the key here is there's always room for improvement in your skill at this game or any other as long as you are introspective and focus on improving to get to where you want to be. And hopefully you've got a friend or two who will help you along the way. And hey, to be honest, something that actually helped me a lot early on was spectating the player that defeated me. And not out of spite with hoping to see them lose or upset that they beat me, it's just out of desire to see how they play the game. If someone defeats you and you get to spectate them and they're really good at Apex, watch what they do. See how they play the game. Study their choices and their movements to see if they are doing something that maybe you should consider doing yourself to help you win more often. And for every match you lose, just remember that someone else has lost a dozen more times. So you know, you're not the worst. Let me know in the comments below how the Switch version of Apex Legends is going for you so far. Do you like it? Do you dislike it? Do you think you'll keep playing it? I will. <laughs> also, are you playing Apex Legends for the very first time now that it's on the Switch? If so, I'm quite interested to hear your take on it. I love hearing from you all. Thank you for watching this 
And remember to keep the fun first. GG, dingus.